Okay, I need air, y'all. I'm dying. Hello, my shuddy base. Hello, my besties. We are once again in the car. Nothing new here. Hold on. I feel alive. We are going to be opening some books today. Yes, finally. Okay, so a couple months ago, I got back home. Like, I was visiting family. I literally was gone for like three months. And then when I got back home, there was a million packages. However, most of those were like PR boxes and stuff like that. So they weren't things from you guys. In these videos, I like to keep strictly like stuff you guys send me because it's, it's a you and me moment. You know what I mean? Like, I want to talk about the books that you guys are sending me. I want to read your notes. I want this to be fully about you. And I was waiting to open all those books. But then I was like, okay, well, some of them are PR packages. It's going to take forever to like see which one's which. So let's give it up for Giant because he's the king of this video. Hold on, round of applause. Because he literally went through every single package. He opened everything. He separated everything you guys sent me and then everything that wasn't from you guys. So I already put away all those other books. And I have here just the stuff that you guys sent me. And I'm going to be reading the notes. He put all the notes inside the books. We love that. Thank you so much to anybody that ever sends me anything. Because you guys have no idea how much it means to me. Thank you so, so much. I love you to the bottom of my core. That doesn't even make any fucking sense. Besties, this video is sponsored by Green Chef. Thank you so much, Green Chef, for sponsoring today's video. Green Chef is a CCOF certified organic company and they have options for every lifestyle. Keto, paleo, vegan, vegetarian, fast and fit, Mediterranean, and gluten-free. Tonight I'm making the chicken with basil pesto. Green Chef is perfect for me and Giant because it comes with enough portions for both of us and it saves me a ton of time. And the meals are always delivered to my doorstep every week so everything is fresh. My favorite part about this is it makes it's so easy for you to just eat healthy and eat something delicious every single night. Green Chef also makes it very easy for you to customize your orders, whether you're mixing and matching or you're having different things for your dietary preferences. The consistency is amazing, the quality is amazing, and they have some of the best ingredients. You don't have to meal plan, you don't have to grocery shop, and you don't even have to prep for the week. Everything is pre-made, pre-measured, and all the sauces, dressings, spices come ready for you. If you love HelloFresh like me, Green Chef is now owned by HelloFresh and they offer even more meal plans to choose from. You can use my code later read 60 to get 60% off plus free shipping on your first box you can go to greenchef.com for more details so first of all um god of pain the princess is taken by the god of pain what here's the note oh here's the note hi larissa thank you so much for sharing the best book rex you're amazing you're amazing the dark romance series nearly made my head explode maybe they can help you out of your reading slump <laughs> Sending lots of love from Anna. Anna, sweetie, here's the thing. The reading slump, it is slumping. It is slumping hard. We don't know if I'm going to be able to get help. But the fact that you sent me a Rena Kent book, I have been wanting to get more into her books. I've only read one, like the very first one in one of her series. It's like I was going in the order, the very first one, the one I read. And I liked it, but I didn't love it. I heard this is her best series, like Legacy of God. Yeah, God of Pain. Anna, thank you so, so much for thinking of me, for wanting me to get out of my slump. You're amazing. I love you so incredibly much. Where do I put the ones that I already, I already looked at? Because the ones that I didn't are all right here to the right to the right but there's no way for me to go to the left to the left because this is my door therefore it would be outside the car maybe in the back i'll do it in the back yeah next one we've got is the ma oh you guys are sending me thrillers you guys love me for real oh my gosh yes you know that i'm on my thriller kick right now a dead body is one mess she can't clean up on her own okay molly tell me more she enters a suite of the famous Charles Black only to find him dead, very dead in his bed. Y'all, he's not dead, okay? He's very dead, he's beyond dead. There's no saving this man. Oh, they suspect her of the murder. Oh no. Nice, wait, this looks so good. Larissa, your aura reminds me of deep red and orange sunsets on a summer day. <laughs> no. Every time I open packages from you guys, I cry, every single time, like, who am I? Oh my god, and I have my period too, so you can't blame me. Don't blame me, your love made me crazy. It's from Risa Rose. Oh, Risa Rose. Risa, thank you so much. I hope I'm saying that right. I love you. The fact that my aura reminds you of a deep red in sunsets. Sunsets. Literally my favorite fucking thing in the world is what my aura reminds you of. No, I'm gonna cry about this all day. Like, I'm gonna call my mom after this and I'm gonna tell her that you said that and that it was the greatest thing I've ever heard in my life. Thank you so much for giving me this book. I'm so excited to read The Maid. I'm on my thriller era, as you guys know, so I will be reading this soon. Thank you so much, Risa. Mwah! Your aura reminds me of sunshine and of love because that's what I'm feeling right now. Oh my gosh, I'm literally gonna cry. 
again. Let's see what we've got next. What is this? Offside rules of the game book one. Oh, is it giving hockey? Look at this cover. Oh, it's thick. She thick or whatever. Okay. Hold on. Let's look at the note. It was so nice meeting you at Lauren's book signing. Oh, yay. I love watching your videos for book recs. This is a five star from me. Hope you like it. Courtney. Courtney, it was so nice to meet you. Are you kidding? Offside. Let's see. After being dumped on her 21st birthday, oh no, it was not fun turning 21. <laughs> Bailey James rebounds right into her, the arms of her ex's biggest competition for the rival team. <gasps> she said, lately I've been dressing for revenge. As soon as the slump is up, oh my god, there's a playlist. Look what you made me do, Taylor Swift. Yes! This is what makes us girls, Lana Del Rey. <gasps> Gracie Abrams. This is amazing. I need to read this book right away. I understand why this is a five star for you, Courtney, because wow, it was so nice to meet you. I love you so incredibly much. Thank you for sending me this. Meeting you was already enough. You didn't need to send me anything, but thank you, thank you, thank you. I cannot wait to read Offside. This looks incredible. I will be telling you guys whether I love this or whether I love this. There's no way I'm gonna hate it. There's no chance because it is hockey. It is rival team. It is X's enemy and it has Taylor Swift in the playlist need i say more thank you courtney i love you next we've got do not disturb by freedom mcfadden my baby oh my goodness yes i've been wanting to get this one actually this is one of the few books by her i do not own it says to avoid spending her life in prison quinn makes a run for it oh no but then an unexpected snowstorm forces her off the road she must take refugee in a hotel unfortunately the baxter motel isn't the quiet safe haven it seemed to be okay quinn do not disturb nice let's look at the notes it says your tiktoks and youtube videos always make my day better i hope you're enjoying this book from aaron p oh aaron i love you you make my day better thank you so much for getting me this book you know how much i love frida mcfadden and how excited i am to literally go through her entire backlist so i will be adding this to my bookshelf my frida bookshelf immediately thank you so so much i love you i love you i love you this one came without a note y'all but it's stephen king's pet cemetery and it doesn't have anything for me to see but obviously one of you guys sent it to me so thank you so so much i love you i need to get on my stephen king grind i really do because i used to love stephen king when i read it i did feel like he gave too much detail that i didn't need that's why the books are so thick but this one doesn't look that thick so i think i can do it it says sometimes dead is better nice yeah to whoever sent me this i love you and thank you this one is oh Oh, Elsie Silver, baby. It's photo finished by Elsie Silver. It says, for introducing me to books and authors I love, especially Archer's voice, Elsie Silver and Juniper Hill. Thank you for always brightening my day and making me smile with your booktube and TikTok. Love your jokes and TV references from Nadine. Nadine, I love you. The fact that you love my TV references and my jokes, you just get me. You just get who I am because I do be laughing at my own jokes and I do be wondering if you guys are laughing too. And it's nice to know that some of you out there are. <laughs> A photo finished by LZ Silver. This is the new, like, covers. I'm so excited to um, read this series. I haven't read it yet. I've only read Chestnut Springs, and that's one of my favorite small town series of all time. You guys know. I talk about it enough. It's a small town second chance romance. Woohoo! Oh, it's Violet's story. Oh, <gasps> yeah. I think this is like the third book in the series or something. I don't know, but I'm very excited to read the entire series. I will be reading it in order, fret not. I love you so much, Nadine. I love you, I love you, I love you. That reminds me of Michael Cordero's partner in Jane the Virgin. Her name was Nadine. You don't care. I love you. Thank you. Look at this. I've never seen this before. Love is a cruel game to play. It's called guilt. Look at that. Whoa. It's giving Gossip Girl and like Magnolia Parks energy. And the note looks pretty. Hi, Louis. I hope you're reading some awesome books. This one's kind of like Magnolia Parks and I thought you'd like it. Happy reading, Elise. Elise, thank you. She literally said it's like Magnolia Parks, which is my shit. Immediately, yes. Oh, I'll be reading this immediately. Don't worry. Don't worry. Say no more. I'm going to love it and I will be reading it immediately. Thank you so fucking much. Like, the fact that you said it's like Magnolia Parks already sold me, and I love the cover, and I love the feel of it. You know when you just love the feel of a book? That's me with this one right now. <gasps> Frenched by Melanie Harlow! I love Melanie Harlow! I love Frenched. This book is so good, and the fact that it's the pretty new cover, yes. Yes, I've already read it. It literally is like, um, I read it on Kindle. It's, she, like, gets broken up with right before her wedding and then she still goes on the honeymoon but she goes alone and then she meets this hot guy who's like i'll give you a tour while you're here and boy does he <laughs> 
<laughs> don't let this cover fool you. This book is very spicy. <laughs> it says, just because I love you and our shared love for Melanie Harlow. Thank you for being you, my love. Maria! Maria! I literally love Maria so fucking much. You guys don't understand. You are everything to me. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. It's you and me. That's my whole world. Next, we've got Twisted by Emily McIntyre, a never after novel. I love this book. Hi, Larry, you're just an icon. Thank you for the endless recs and most entertaining YouTube videos of all time. Oh my gosh, what an honor. It's from Ashley. Ashley! I love you, I love you, I love you, I love you. I read the arc of it on my Kindle and I never had the paperback, so thank you so much for sending this to me. I'm so excited to put it right next to Hooked, Scarred, and Wretched. Scarred is my favorite in the Never After series, but I still really enjoy Twisted. Twisted is an Aladdin retelling. I don't like to call these retellings because they're really not. It's basically the villain getting the girl, you know? So this is Jafar with Jasmine and I love the fucking cover. So thank you so much, Ashley. I love you and thank you for saying I have the most entertaining YouTube videos that honestly makes me so happy because I feel like oftentimes we're very hard on ourselves and I do that a lot where I'm like, oh, are my videos like good enough? Like are people really enjoying them? And I compare myself and that's so, such a bad thing to do. And so hearing that you guys enjoy the videos, that makes me really happy. I love you. Whoa, this one's different. Lucas, look at that. It's a Preston Brothers novel. Ah, wait, what is this? In sprint, every millisecond counts. When you're waiting for love, those milliseconds can feel like eons. What the fuck? There's like yarn all over the book. Is she a yarner? What does she do? What's happening? Oh, it's best friends to lovers. Ooh wee. Hi, Larissa. Hi. I haven't read this book yet, but I've read the More Than series by this author and I enjoyed it. So I hope you enjoy the first book in the series. Oh, thank you so much for sending me the first book. You're a real one. Hope you have a beautiful day from Tiffany Ho. Tiffany, I hope you have a beautiful day, my queen. Thank you so much for sending me this. I hope that your day is magical. I hope all the good things come to you. I hope your coffee tastes the best it's ever tasted. That's what I hope for you. When I was a kid, there was this student in my class and his name was Lucas and he like really liked me and so he made his mom name his sister like when his sister was born Larissa. So there's a little Larissa out there that was named Larissa because the little Lucas liked me. How cute is that? I was like five years old. I don't even know what I did to make this, this kid like me but he did and it was adorable and I will never forget it. So, <laughs> so the name Lucas is a yes for me. I'm very excited to read this. <laughs> Thank you so much, Tiffany. I love you. I will let you know how this is so that you can read it too. Oh, y'all, of course. Of course you did this. Of course. Why am I not surprised that you guys are getting me Akatar books because you want me to read them so bad? This is A Court of Mist and Fury. Don't even know which one this is. Is this book three? Is this book two? I don't know. The note literally says, I'm on my knees begging you to read this, Destiny. Oh my gosh, it's from Destiny! <laughs> Destiny! I'm giggling. <laughs> oh, there's a man. As being on her knees waiting for me to read the series is so fucking funny because I know she loves it to her core and I am not ready. If you guys don't know Des, I love her with my entire heart. Literally, Des and Sarah are some of my favorite people in the entire world. I have nothing but amazing things to say about them. Their aesthetic, their friendship, their videos, everything about them. I stand. And the fact that Des got me this book just makes me so fucking happy because she really wants me to read this series. And will I? We don't know. <laughs> I will. Des, I love you. And I'm going to do it just for you. Literally just because you're asking me. Is this your favorite book in the series? Is that why you got me this one? I'll do it. <laughs> I'm not going to promise, but I'll do it. <laughs> Speaking of Akatar, y'all, hold on. <laughs> we also have this. This one says, Hi Larissa, you deserve the world. Thank you for all the book recs and everything bookish you do. I love you. This is one of my favorites. I hope you enjoy. From Lynn. Lynn, sweetie, sweetie angel girl queen. Thank you so much for getting me this. Of course, this is one of your favorites. I'm not surprised at all. A Court of Wings and Ruin. What order does this series go in? Look how thick these are. Help me. I know A Court of Thorns and Roses is the first one. I do own that one. And now I own these two. Uh, I, uh, I'll read it. <laughs> 
Lynn, I love you so much. Thank you for your kind words. Literally, you saying that I deserve the world. And thank you for everything I do. Are you kidding? Thank you for everything you do. Thank you for letting me do this. Like, thank you for being here. Thank you for sending me this. Thank you for even thinking of me. I love you so, so much. And I, I need to read this. I need to read this. We've got Welcome to the Dark Side, Gianna Darling, baby. Okay, I was a good girl. I ate my vegetable. <laughs> I was a good girl. I ate my fucking vegetables. Like, okay, go off queen, you do you. Then I got cancer. Oh, that took a turn. This says, I wanted to send you one of my favorite books to give you a small amount of joy that you give me. Your warm personality has given me so much peace over the past few days. All my heart, thanks and love you from Sydney. <laughs> Sydney, I love you. Literally like the joy that I give you, you give me. So it's just joy all around on this channel. <laughs> what have you given me? Welcome to the dark side. Because I, I'm scared by that description in the back. At first I was giggling and cackling, and now I'm like, oh, this book is sad. And also this series, I heard it's like, if you like Sons of Anarchy, you would like it. And Sons of Anarchy is one of my favorite shows. So, like, I would love it. Yes. Sydney, I love you. I love you. I love you. You give me so much joy. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Oh my god, y'all. Oh my god. Oh my god. The new cover to some kind of perfect. Ah. Oh my god. Lily and Lowe, Daisy and Rick, Rose and Connor. Yeah. Yes! Let me go read the ending again. <laughs> I love them so much! Hello there, fellow Addicted Calloway sisters and Mariana Zapata stan. That's me! Thank you for always sharing your genuine love for books and authors with us, even if it takes ages and too many cups of coffees to create that perfect video. <laughs> Yes. As a Callaway fan for so many years, I'm so grateful to see someone champion for those books. It's from Abby. Abby, thank you so much. <gasps> I love the flowers. I love the cover. And you know what? I know exactly where I'm going to put it. I'm going to put it right on top of my other scop cover. And it's just going to, it's going to look so cute. I already have a vision. I have a vision and you have given that vision to me. Thank you so much. I love you. And of course, I'm always here to make everybody read Addicted Callaway. That is what I'm here for. If I'm not making everybody read Addicted Callaway, Magnolia Park, and boys of Tommen, then I'm not doing my duty as a human being. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, wait. Oh my gosh, wait. Oh my gosh, wait. The other books in that series. Oh my gosh, wait, Girl Queen also sent me these. Hold on, hold on, pause everything. Anna also sent me these books. <gasps> Anna, that's why she said this dark romance series. She got me the entire thing. Anna, are you kidding? Now I have to cry one more time. <laughs> oh my god, there's playlists on all of these and look how pretty they look. Look at this. <gasps> so it's God of Pain. The princess is taken by the God of Pain. Then God of Wrath. I'm trapped by the devil. <gasps> God of Malice. I caught the attention of a monster. Now, what order these go in? I don't know. Why don't they say like number one, number two? Number three, you know what I mean? I don't really know what order these go in, but I'm, I will figure it out before I read them, worry not. I'm literally even more excited now that I have all three. Oh my God, Anna, Anna, why you did me like this? I just love you so much, I don't deserve this, wow. Wow. Ooh, look how cute this looks. Mix of kin. This is the new cover. <gasps> I love that. It says, hi, Larissa. I just wanted to say that I love you. I love you and the videos you do. I just read this book and I would love to hear what you think of it. Best wishes. And from your bestie in Sweden. <gasps> Mira. Hi, Mira. Thank you so much. I hope I'm saying that right. I have the other cover of this and I kid you not, I've been looking at this cover and I've been like, I need that one. Like, do I need it? No. But do I want it? Yes. And Mita said, yes, you need it. Here it is. Ah, I'm so excited to read it. Thank you so, so much. And if you liked it, it means I'm going to like it because I trust you, my sweet and bestie. Thank you. I love you. I love you. I love you. Oh, my God. Y'all, it's the last book in that series. Well, it's not the last book, but it's the one I didn't have. Book five, The Annihilator. This is the Darkverse series, and this is the next book. I love your videos. You remind me so much of myself. I love you and I hope you enjoy this book as much as I did. It's from Gabrielle. Um, Gabrielle, I love you. I love you and I know that I'll enjoy the series. I know. That's the thing. I know. I just haven't gotten to it yet. What happens when the most ruthless obsession finds its darkest fixation? Okay. Annihilation is born. Ooh! Okay. Say no more! So this is part of the Darkverse series, y'all. It's the fifth book and I'm gonna put it right next to all the other books and I'm going to be reading this soon. I'm going to. Mark my fucking words, okay? Gabrielle made sure of it. Thank you so, so much. I'm so excited. <gasps> Shut the fuck up. Shut up. Ah, the new covers. 
No, no you did not. No you did not. Ah! Enjoy your gift. You're the reason I started this series. I'm absolutely obsessed. I owe you my life for introducing me to two of my favorite series, Addicted Calloway and Boys of Tom and I love you, Salma. I love you. I love you. Are you kidding? Oh my god. Two of your favorite series. You're just like me for real. For real. I love you so much. I'm gonna put these right next to the OG covers. I was so excited for these covers and I just hadn't purchased them yet. And you said, hurry up. You said, here it is. I love you. <laughs> here we've got, oh, I haven't seen this one before. All the little things. All the small things, la la. Every time I watch one of your videos, I feel like I'm hanging out with my best friend. Yes, yes, that is the, exactly the goal because we are best friends. You are a little queen. Please never stop being you and I and know that you're very appreciated from Tiffany. Ah, I love you. Thank you so much. This honestly, like the notes are my favorite part. It just makes me smile so big. I've never seen this book before, but it looks really good. Four years ago, my life was changed. One kiss, one moment. Five words. Enjoy all the little things. Okay. I like the cover. Look, it's so cute looking. This book looks so cute. First kiss almost killed me, but the second one brought me to life. Okay, this is dramatic. <laughs> Tiffany, I love you so much. Thank you. Thank you for thinking of me. Thank you for sending me a gift. I love you. I love you. I love you. And hopefully one day I'll get to give you the biggest hug. Okay, Wildcat, Rebecca Jenshack. Oh. This literally is another hockey book. I need to like go through all the hockey romances because y'all know I love to be some hockey romance. This is Wildcat. One of my friends loves this book, so I trust it. Hi, Larissa. So I wanted to say thank you for breaking me out of the longest reading slump of my life. These books are a small token of my gratitude for inspiring me to reclaim my love for reading. From Ghost. Ghost, I love you. I love you. I love you. I love you. Ghost, boo. Ah. <laughs> I love you so much. I'm so glad that I could help you get out of a reading slump. Now, if only I could help myself. That got sad real quick. I love you. Thank you for sending me this. I'm very excited to read this book. Like I said, one of my friends like vouches for this book. And so I trust it. And I do like Rebecca Jenshack. Wildcat, get your head in the game. Now we've got Play With Me by Becca Mack. Yes, I have Consider Me. And I didn't have Play With Me. So thank you so much for sending me this because I read it on Kindle and I really enjoyed this one. Even like more than Consider Me, I would say. But I don't know why I didn't have the paperback. Hi, Larry. I hope you love Gary and Jenny as much as I did. Thank you for always bringing a smile to my face. From Katie. Katie, I love you. You are so welcome for always bringing a smile to your face. That is what I'm here for. I am here to make you smile, honestly. That, like, that is already the best gift to me. Oh, y'all. The Retribution of Mara Dyer. This is the last one I needed because I have the first two. Your vids were the only thing that made me laugh some weeks. I love you. I'm gonna cry. Can't thank you enough for that. But this is me trying. This is me trying. Holding you accountable and finishing the series you started. <laughs> Can't wait to hear your thoughts. <laughs> it's from Nini. Thank you so much, Nini. Oh, I dropped the note. Oh no. Thank you so much, Nini. Thank you for holding me accountable because I'm not gonna lie to you. I forgot I started the series. I did start book one. I mean, I finished book one. I never did book two or three. So I need to finish it. I do because I was enjoying it. I loved Mara and I loved Noah. So I need to finish the series. Thank you for holding me accountable. <laughs> Nini, I love you. And I'm so glad that I could make you smile on weeks that are tough. That's one of the most important things to me because I, I feel you. I understand anxiety, depression, and all of that. So some weeks are harder than others. And if I can make you literally smile just one little second, that already makes me so happy. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh, the next one we have is Ghosted. I love this book. I've literally been meaning to own this book. I read it on Kindle and I fucking loved it and I just never got the paperback. Thankful for BookTube for bringing you into my life. This is one of my faves, Sarah. Not me literally just talking about Sarah five seconds ago and then Sarah sending me this book. Are you fucking kidding me? Let me just reiterate one more time that I love Sarah and everything she is. BookTube bringing me to her just makes me so happy. I would have never come across this person if it wasn't for a book too, because we obviously live so far apart, we would have never met, but now it's literally someone I consider a very good friend. And that's fucking crazy. Like, BookTube did that. That's insane. I love you. I love you, I love you, I love you. Specifically talking to you. You looking at me? I love you. Ooh, now we've got Deviant King. This is a royal elite book. Okay, so this is another Rena Kent book. Rena Kent has so many universes, y'all. I'm confuzzled. This says, I really love this series and I can't wait for Eli and Ava's book. I hope you enjoy the book. Love you so much. You're one of my favorite people and your content has made life a little easier to handle. From Yvette. No, because you can't write shit like that and expect me not to sob. You can't. 
What do you mean life has been easier to handle with my videos? Life has been easier to handle with you in my life. Thank you so much, Yvette. Are you kidding? Thank you for sending me this book. Thank you for being here. I love you. Never forget that if life seems tough, there's one little Larry out there who loves the shit out of you. Now we got the good lie. Okay. A.R. Torre. I think this is also a... A thriller. It says, you were my comfort character when I was sick last week. Oh my god, I was sick last week too. Whoa. Literally, I just had your videos on repeat. Consider this a token of my appreciation to support our queen in her thriller mystery era. You're the best from Danny. Oh, I love you, Danny. And you knew that I'm in a thriller mystery era. You know me so well. Thank you. Honestly, me being a comfort character in your life when you were sick just makes me so happy because I was literally sick last week too. And I was unwell so i feel you i feel you on needing that one thing that just brings you comfort and the fact that i was able to be yours is just insane mine was the big bang theory <laughs> but you didn't ask anyway danny thank you so much i will be reading this because you know i'm in my thriller era and i will tell you how it is maybe you can read it too buddy read question mark wait y'all these last two are also from danny it's the same note so danny not only sent me this one but she also sent me these Danny! Oh my god! She sent me Gothicana by Runix, which is the same author of the Darkverse series. This I hear such good things about. I hear it's like dark academia, dark romance, a little bit forbidden, I think it is. I don't really know, but it looks good. There's a playlist! Lana Del Rey! Immediately, yes. I don't need anything else. You have Lana, so I'm there. And then she also got me a flicker in the dark, which I hear amazing things about too. This is a thriller. When Chloe Davis was 12, six girls went missing in her small town, and it was her own father who confessed to the murders. And now 20 years later, the murders start happening again, but he's in prison. Oh my gosh, that sounds exactly like one of the other books I just read by Frida McFadden. I don't remember exactly what it was called. Oh my god, that sounds amazing. Are you fucking kidding me? <gasps> I want to read this one right Right away and it says that there's plot twist which i love i love you know i'm a whore for plot twists danny thank you so much literally you were the sick one i should have sent you books put your wish list down below so i can send you books as well thank you so much for thinking of me and thank you for literally like putting my videos when you're sick that means the world to me that i could help you even a little bit I love you. Thank you for these books. I will be reading them immediately. Yay! Those are all the books we had to open today, Shoddy Bays. I love you so much. Again, if you ever send me a book, I, I love you. Thank you guys so much for always being so kind to me and for just taking me in with open arms. I love you and I want to hug you all. Literally all of you. All at once. Just like this. Okay, there's somebody parking next to me and he's looking at me weird. I gotta go. Love you so much.